And now it's the final freaking episode. So let's the onslaught begin. Here we go again. Bad time simulator. Ready? Oh, she nearly got it. Here me. Here me. Here we go. Here we go. That opening is just going to screw me over for a long time. Now, Crow did the editing for this, so I have no idea what the hell he's done to this video. Because this has been like cut down for about six hours of footage. Four hours. I like how he dances to the music. <laughs> yeah. You know, you know, something I've noticed in this game uh, uh, is that whenever a character moves, that means they're definitely going to kill you. Like, because um, whenever a character doesn't move, then like like Papyrus doesn't move when when he fights you, which means like, because he can't act, because you can't actually lose to Papyrus, because like once you get to one HP, he basically spares you. Mm -hmm. But everyone else who moves can kill you in the game. So it's just a it's just a theme I've noticed. Mm. Sure. Oh, yes. Timeline jumping left and right, stopping and starting. It implies that Sans knows ex of every of any and every timeline that exists in the world of Undertale. So he's, so he's Deadpool. Hey, listen to that epic trumpet solo. Until suddenly everything ends. So he no he he know, so he yeah. just he knows a lot more than what we know. Mm. Yeah. And oh my god. It the first of many. <laughs> the first of many. The first of many. Is there an echo in here? I think there the is. The first of many. <laughs> first of many. I'm an idiot! Hmm. That expression. That's the expression of someone who's died five times in a row. Convenient, huh? That's one for each finger. But soon. <laughs> it's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. On days like this, kids like you. <laughs> I got it! <laughs> Interrupted again. Here we go. Here we go. I like how he sometimes f decides to finish the speech, and other times he won't. <laughs> <laughs> Cocky little bastard. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> Cocky well, little freak! This is probably one of the easiest bits to do, is just that little jumping thing. Yep. What? You think I'm just gonna stand here and take it? <laughs> you felt your sins crawling on you your back. You felt your sins. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the thing. The best friend necklace, if you notice, we have a little pink extra as part of our health. What that does oh, yeah. is that it's an actual slower decrease of our health. Mm -hmm. So the so yellow is where our actual health is, but the pink is kind of cuts it in half. Right. It's kind of, po it's kind of poison damage. Yep. Yeah. It's like a little platform game in here. Yes. Oh shit. Uh, well, just about to survive that. It's always that last one that I always fuck up on. Aye. Hmm. So how so 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 Kari, tell me, how many hours did this ultimately take you? It took me three days of recording and constantly having to take breaks in the beforehand. Hmm. Oh god. <laughs> wow. I don't think I I don't think I've had something that frustrating since I was trying to catch Rayquaza in Pokemon Ruby. Death again? That was a fucking. <laughs> Dead again. Right. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I caught Rayquaza in an Ultra Ball in the first attempt. I am such. Oh, he's I am such a liar. He is easy to catch in with an Ultra Ball. He is. Like, seriously. Okay. Hmm, that's an expression. Hmm. That's an expression of someone who's died six times in a row. That's the number of fingers on a mutant hand. But soon... Or if you're from Norfolk. <laughs> <laughs> Is he gonna skip it? Is he gonna skip? Is he gonna skip? I don't know. On days like these, kids yes. like you... Is good. 
Oh. It'd be funny if there's one where, like, does he... It'd be funny if there was one where he doesn't even do the speed, he just goes straight into that. Pretty yeah, much. I think he time. does sometimes. He does. That is the second time. Oh, you think you're gonna here? He doesn't even. He does like he doesn't. Like, he doesn't even say it's a beautiful day outside. He just goes straight into the. Attack. Yeah, because he's already. Yeah, that's hey, when you did that's it. That's when you initiate the fight the second time. Remember? Hmm. Oh yeah. On the other hand, this track is fucking amazing. Yeah, Megan. I gotta get this. I have. I have to get this soundtrack at some point. Yeah, Megan Levani is a good song. It comes with the game. Yeah. It comes with the game, actually. You can buy the soundtrack on Steam. Mmm. Nice. Oh, the title does remind me of like a Castlevania song. Yeah, that's exactly what the vibe is. Really. No, no, the, the name reminds me of Castlevania. Yeah, it does. Megalovania. Yeah, Megalovania. Yeah, it does remind us. Uh, of course, Konami goes, Castlevania? What's that? We can't, we can't hear you with the sound of our pachinko balls. They're gay. That's implying they that that way. That's implying they have balls. Oh, of course they are. They're gay. Um. Well, uh. how convenient the heart breaks does enough like you know. <laughs> anyway. Yes, this video is mostly going to consist of me dying. So, Crow, I thought you edited out a lot of this. <laughs> I thought I did too, but I think, you know, San managed, managed to just edit it back in. Yeah, <laughs> mm, that expression, that's an expression of someone who's tied seven times in a row. Hey, that's good. Seven swords would be a lucky number. Who knows? Maybe you'll hit the checkpot. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. Hey, on, that car is reading it. Sorry. On days like these, kids like you. Oh, did it. <laughs> Sight you out that one. I think, I, th I think Sans. I think by this point knows he's gonna be burning in hell, so he doesn't even need to say. Mm. It. Yeah. <laughs> it's like yeah, yeah, hell, etc. There we go. Yeah, that's pre pretty in character for Sans. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to hell. Bye. Ah, <laughs> oh, James, if this soundtrack yeah? was in Jet Set Radio. Yeah, I could sort of picture mm. that. Oh. Why does he keep saying you felt a thing crawling up your back? A uh, thing crawling Sins. up your back. Oh, okay. It's all the, you know, all the people killed we killed. People. So we've sinned. Alright. So, due to this, this actually, this whole battle actually spawned a song, a band song, that is a parody of Stronger Than You from Steven Universe. Yeah, I, I like that mm. song. Yeah. And that's actually how James spoiled this fight actually happening for himself. Because some well, I did have an idea song, that, and I told him not well, to click on it. Well, I had an idea that you were gonna fight Sans at some point. I didn't know when. Although the weird thing is, someone told me is you put, you fought him in the pacifist run. I was like, what? No, you don't. You don't. Like, whoever no, told you, you that was a that. fucking lie. Yeah. Yeah, you, that never happens. So, but it was on the internet, so it must be true. It's all going to reset. Important advice there. So Sans knew about all the resets. <laughs> which makes you think, maybe, like the player, and unlike Flowey, he actually knows when the resets happen, even... Oh shit, this is turning into a Mario ROM hack. Yep, it is. Oh Jesus. Oh fuck. <laughs> Look, like I, said, I it's gave like, up it's trying to go back a long time ago. He's, it's implied that Sans resetted so many times. Well, no, that he's been I... through so many resets. So why did he yeah. say that he's actually tried going back? Just, I'm getting to the surface that doesn't have a skill anymore. You know what's also depressing when you really think about it? That means um, he knows that his relationship with um, Torio can't go anywhere because of the resets. Because he knows because well, because he knows that it's gonna it's gonna reset. So whatever friendship he made with Torio won't matter anymore because you know the world resets, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. 
pretty depressing if you think about it. Hmm. A little bit of self-awareness? Yeah, that's the thing about Sans. I think he's more, more aware of the fourth wall than we, than we are. Because mm -hmm. even, even if we do, we'll just end up right back here without any memory of it, right? Yeah. So as you can see, his eyes disappear, which no, makes you know that he's getting serious. Hmm. I always, I always assume whenever the eye, whenever the pupils disappear, that mean that that's him talking to you, the player. Mm. Yeah, it is. But it's also when he's being very serious. Yeah. I thought it was when the glowing eyeball popped up. No. That's just when he. That's just when he just goes full on psycho and, wants, and definitely wants you dead. Mm. <laughs> yeah. That's basically going. That's him basically going into Jack the Ripper mode. <laughs> I think it's time for Jack to let her rip. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or is it just a poor excuse of being lazy? Hell if I know. Mm. <laughs> oh shit. Fucking flash, fucking quick man stage reminder there. Yeah. Oh shit. The, the good thing about the good thing about the fight you may eventually. All I know is seeing what's coming next. I can't afford not to care anymore. So he knows what you're gonna do as soon as you get past him. So does he say that on like the first playthrough you had of this? No, he says that every play, every time you fight him. Hmm. Because he has some memory, but not all memory. Yeah. Mm. Well. Hmm. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, that being said, you uh, hello, hello. really like to swing that thing around, huh? Listen, I know you don't. Uh, Somehow sure. in there, I can feel it. Somewhere. There's a glimmer of a good person inside of you. The memory of someone who once wanted to do the right thing. Oh, okay. Someone who, uh, in another time, might have even been no, uh, a friend. No, no, it's all right. Come on, buddy. Uh, okay. uh, I'm, do you I'm, remember I'm, me? I'm, Please, if you're I listening, think about it. Hold on. let's forget all about this, okay? Just lay down your weapon and, well, okay. my job is not easier. Now, uh, this, uh, this is what happens if you do spare him. Finally, buddy, pal. I know how hard it must be to make that choice. To go back on everything you've grown up to. I want you to know, I won't let it go to waste. Come here, pal. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is what get dunked on. Get dunked on. Well, this is what happens when you decide to give him a hug. If we're really friends, we're really friends, you won't come back. You won't come back. That's the so number of figures on a spider. But soon. But soon. <laughs> That was now great. the montage happens. Montage begins! The expression. Mm. That's the expression for him to die. I. Nope. Wait. That's definitely nine. That's definitely Sorry. nine. Or was it ten? <laughs> this is just fun. Oh, no, stop. <laughs> You're still a pad! Hmm, that expression. That's the expression of someone who's died ten times in a row. Hey, congrats. That's a big one, huh? Let's invite all your friends over for... We can have pie and hot dogs and... Hmm, wait. Something's not right. You don't have any friends. That's you, Kari. Uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the dog! Why? <laughs> so, I... so I put this... So I put this in because that okay, Kari had to like you know go back and buy everything to make sure she doesn't fuck up the next fight. <laughs> <laughs> no, I had to make sure I had a lot of health items because I realised that technically um, a lot of the items I had were not good enough. So shut up. <laughs> that expression. That's the expression of someone who's died eleven times in a row. Well, give or take. There's dudes, there's dudes. I don't think I'll be able to count very well, very well over here. Count for me, okay? Well, start from 12. Just so you know, look at those fucking bones at the bottom. Sans can now, at one point in the game, will literally attack you. Whoa! Even before you can fight. 
<laughs> Dead. Because the bones will appear. And here it comes. And try and hear Here it you. comes. Get dug, dog, cow. Fifteen. I saw this in advance la last when it was uploaded. I fucking couldn't stop kicking either. <laughs> Death is funny. Don't go. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. This is hilarious. Anyway. Uh, oh! No! <laughs> 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 That's the sound of misery! You're a loser. You're a loser. <laughs> 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 I'm going to kill you when I get my hands. <laughs> 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 Let's just get to the point. Yeah, just so you know, this is literally how I managed to cope. I was literally singing that parody song. And then it just was each So, yeah, this was literally what I was singing while I was recording. Uh, uh, you guys hear singing? Yeah. So finally mastered this bit. Yay! Okay. Up, see, up, 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 up. Yo, this is this bit. So I'm the only wait. I'm the only one hearing us singing, right? Yeah, that is literally me. That is okay. me singing. Because I was trying to cope at this point, so I've gone nearly insane. Ah, uh, okay. So, Crow, I would like to point out something, you idiot. You missed out the bit where you get back to Sans after he spares you. No, I, I did. You did, because he said something <laughs> I, different. I still can't. Yeah, do but I, I, I. He said he. This is what he says. He says it's like, huh? You seem like you're not surprised by that at all, huh? Don't tell the other Sans, okay? Yeah, dude, but uh, dude, I, I thought the, the dunked on thing was funnier. <laughs> if I knew you were going to do that, I would have given you the um, sand spreadsheet I made. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> just to add to it. Just, just screw you. Yeah. Just screw you guys. It's going to be a surprise. <laughs> oh, okay, it's cool. That was fucking brilliant. That was brilliant. Just so you know, you can literally see how much of a rhythm I've got going now to doing certain parts. Mm. I think you actually finally got to all what you're supposed to actually do. Literally, this is like this is like the this is like the Dark Souls method. You die so many times, you get a pattern going. Mm -hmm. That's not like the Mega Man method to me. Trial and error. Yeah, I think I think the Dark Souls method was a lot would, would, would apply here. Yeah, Mega Man came first. Mega Man came first, but recently for Dark Souls. Specifically since the third one's now supposed to be game of the fucking year so far. Uh-huh, anyway. Moving on. Yeah, moving on. Yes. Keep going and... I'm, I'm no longer singing at this point because I'm just like, fuck. Mm. I think on some pits I keep going like tippy-tap, tippy-tap, tippy-tap because it only takes like tiny little taps on your arrow. On the arrow keys to actually get through some bits. Mm. At least the music's pretty good. Oh yeah. yeah, I agree. See if you fall for it again. No. This is normally a great area where you can literally just quickly heal up yourself to max health without any consequences. Hmm.
Well, it's worth a shot. Guess she like things the hard way, huh? Whoa. Whoa, Jesus. The fuck? Yeah, this is what he does if you don't spare him. He is a gauntlet. And as you can see, there is now a phone waiting for you to hit on attack. Just like mm. swinging in. So he can do damage to you without even initiating a fight. That's an asshole thing to do. Woo! Oh, this was you getting dug. This was this is when you was getting dug on. Not really. The real battle. Real battle is okay. Whoa. What the fuck? Situational points. Okay. Maybe they'll, all they need was, I don't know, some good food, some bad laughs, and nice friends. At least this, but you can, you can even get through. Yeah. And look, the bones are now freaking out the bottom now, so if you try and hit on Act or even items, that type of oh, person who won't ever be happy. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Have to move off. You'll keep consuming time like over and over. And take from me because someday you gotta learn to quit. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's definitely one way of solving that bit. So, if you, didn't, if you didn't make any ex um, errors, how long would this fight go on for? Not that long. Reading this I mean, it takes about six minutes, I think, for the whole fight. Right. Yeah, he's speeding it up, that means he's getting closer. So, he, so yeah, he is kind of like a glass cannon. Yeah. Right. Like literally, as you can see, my keyboard—it's—it's it's not even responding to me half the time now. Oh jeez. Well, I'm trying to hit it. Whoa. Oh, fuck. Those are called gaster blasters. Oh, I get. Sans is starting yeah. to look tired. And if you keep pushing me, then I'll be forced to use my special attack. Just so you know, um, if you actually use act and just like check him it will say one xp well one hp easy to kill yeah huh. get ready because after my next move so you don't want to see it you best stop Come on. is it like for viruses you think sounds game re need to use a special attack here we go okay. Oh, here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. nothing. Are you ready? Survive this and I'll show you. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, shit. Like, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, God, this is Baltoat. Uh, How the hell did you. Okay, this is more. Yeah, you can see how I died so often. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, I don't and play this game. Is where I got the fucking hell! Oh Whoa. my god! Oh my fucking god, I've done it! I fucking did it! What? Yeah! Oh my god! The action! Oh my god! Wait, 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 how? Did you record your audio oh, while you were playing? Yes, oh. I did! I said this earlier, James! Fucking listen! Oh. Sons! You fucking son of a bitch! Time for my special attack. Are you ready? I got nothing. <laughs> yeah, I cried because I was so exhausted by this point. <laughs> I see what he's doing. He's that's yeah, it. That's right. It's literally nothing. It's not going to be anything either. <laughs> you get it. 
I know I can't beat you. One of your turns, you're just gonna kill me. So, uh, I've decided it's not gonna be your turn ever. I'm gonna keep using my turn until you give up. Even if it means we have to stand here until the end of time. Capiche? Capiche? Uh, oh, I get As you can see, one eye slightly glows. It's special power. You'll get bored here if you haven't gotten bored already, I mean. And then you'll finally quit. Hmm. Yeah. I know your type. You're uh, very determined, aren't you? You'll never give up. Even if there's uh, absolutely no benefit to preservation whatsoever, make it clear. No matter what, you'll just keep going. Not out of any desire for good or evil, but just because you you think you can. And because you can, you have to. Hmm. Makes sense. So, this is how you progress. You just literally wait for a bit. So, in my personal, my personal opinion, opinion, the, the most determined thing you can do here. What? 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 It's one person to read. Okay. It, Means that I'm trying to activate all his speech, but then look at his tired face. Wow. wow. Like this. Didn't know bones could sweat. Yeah. The only way to progress is just to wait. Yeah, so. Because we're both tired, it gives you a break to just calm the hell down. Yeah. I can imagine, sir, so after go through what, 20, nearly 27 minutes of hell? Not to you guys, I was the one that was playing this. But when he closes his eyes and so on. And sleeping, because of what he does. Shut bet. up! Yeah. Now he is asleep, you now push the box. <laughs> that's, a, that's a different one. Yeah, so you're going to cheat the way by using the game mechanics and breaking the fourth wall just so you can purposely get yourself to the fight button. Wow. That's a, that's a different one. Hmm. Huh? Did you really think I would... Oh. oh. Got him. You hear him twice. Let that curry read it. <laughs> oh. Yes, that's it, huh? Just... Don't say I didn't want you. Well, I'm going to grill these. Wait, what? Wait, shouldn't he get killed? Shush! Wait for it. Papyrus, do you want anything? Uh, Papyrus is dead. Yeah, but by the sounds of it, basically... He's just died off camera, so it's hinted that as he's dying, he can see Papyrus's ghost. Yeah. Okay. So he's literally saying, "Say, like, hey, Papyrus, want anything?" Ah. Uh, okay. Well. That's it. This is all I have fucking left. I used all my items. Nearly. Shit. Well, so... that's, that was it. We just beaten the so fight. So we have beat. We've beaten the hardest boss in the whole game. Oh, shit. Yeah, literally, we're the most powerful thing underground. Nothing can stop us. Yeah, but there's one little extra bit. One more. Now he keep now Flower keeps talking to us as if we're another person. And as we discovered in the pacifist run. He actually saw us as another person. And right here it says it's as comfortable as it looks. <sighs> when you look at the red coffin. Yeah. Okay. So, the person that he sees us as, and the person that's 
using the red text is one and the same person. Okay. Oh, we do, we do see Asgore. Hey, Asgore. For the third time. Curious. I've never seen a plant cry before. Huh? You must be the one the flower just warned me about. Howdy. Um, what kind of monster are you? Sorry, I cannot tell. Well, we can always... What? Now, now. There's no need to fight. Why not settle this over a nice cup of tea? Wait. Yep. Did, did you hear that? Why, you... Well, that's fucking dark. Hmm. Is that good? Um, this is Flowey's attack. Yeah. See? I never betrayed you. <laughs> Solid trick. I was waiting to kill him for you. After all, it's me, your best friend. I'm helpful. I promise I won't betray you. I can help. I can. I can. Please don't kill me. And. We just murdered Flowey. Huh. Uh, uh. This is Chara. Greetings. I am Harry. <laughs> Thank you. Your power awakened me from, from death. My human soul, my determination, they were not mine, but yours. At first, I was so confused. Our plan had failed, hadn't it? Why was I brought back to life? You, with your guidance. I realize the purpose of my reincarnation. Power. Together, we eradicated the enemy and became strong. HP, attack, defense, gold, XP, level. Every time a number increases. That feeling. That's me. Kari. <laughs> now, now we have reached the absolute. There is nothing left for us here. Let us erase this pointless world and move on to the next. Now you have a choice of either erasing the world or not. Right, you are a great partner. We'll be together forever, won't we? I think oh. I've been summoned. But just want to say this. Curry, you fucked up. This is what happens when we when I am not in charge of a fucking game. Oh. Well we actually get shit done. Gummy. Either way, if you erase the world and start up your game, it's just a blank screen. Right. And you also should be getting a wind effect as well. I don't think Crow's added. But all you hear is wind, and if you wait for 10 minutes, Chara will actually talk to you again in text because what she has done is she's literally deleted the undertale files from your right. computer the only so i think in some cases you have to Wait download on. the game yeah this is the wind effect you hear if you start the game again 
So if you do the genocide route entirely, you are destroying the whole game. You cannot play it again. You cannot go back to ooh, another file, whatever. Or start a new game. You literally have destroyed the whole thing. So what if you choose the other option? She still does it. Mm. She oh. just betrays you and activates the jump scare instead. Yeah. Well, Kari, you fucked up a dimension and a timeline and edited the LP in the worst way. Congratulations. I'm now oh, back thanks. in... I'm back in charge oh, now. No, you're not. Yes, and I am. My LP's done way before yours. Well, that's unfortunate because now I'm going to be putting you inside the tub. James, put her in the tub. No! Um, we still got about two or three minutes, so... Yeah. yeah. But other uh, than that, though, thoughts? Um, the whole game is a whole... Oh. Oh, wait on. Interesting. You want to go back? You want to go back to the world you've destroyed? It was you who pushed everything to its edge. It was you who led the world to its destruction. But you cannot accept it. You think you are above consequences? Exactly. Well, I guess that's it. Perhaps... We can reach a compromise. You still have something I want. Give it to me. No. And I will bring this world back. Uh. Then it is agreed. You will give me your soul. Uh. Then it is done. If you say no, you have to wait another ten minutes before you activate a chain of events again. Uh, for her to talk right. to you. So, we now can play Undertale again. Mm-hmm. Except we won't. We're done. Yeah. And after that, we then have a tainted playthrough. Permanently destroyed. Yep. What's the tainted playthrough? In the tainted playthrough, that is when you... It's more result in the endings, as we discussed beforehand, where at the end of the pacifist run, you will have um, X's over the faces of your friends if you choose to leave Toriel. If you decide to stay with Toriel, you'll look at the camera with red glowing eyes to show that Char is actually going to kill everyone, no matter what wow. you do. So, at this point, you know, you're fucked up. Yeah. So, lesson learned. So, in other words, don't do genocide run. Exactly. In other words, don't do genocide run. Like, not many people would. And at least I fucking do the genocide run, Howard, who does Overlord for the good route. But you do realise I don't care, right? Yeah, but I've done both versions of the game. Well, Nick, you when we do our when we do our next LP, ladies and gentlemen, we are going back to her summer house. All of us. Hey. That was a lot of fun, though, I must mm. admit. Till next time. Till next time, everybody. Goodbye.